Hi, and welcome to the Media Hunt Report. We're here with Matt George from Urban Activation. And last time we spoke, Matt, we talked about the first half of 2023 and what was happening. We're now getting into midway. What's your seeing in the land? What's happening in property for the second half of 2023? It's definitely a normal market across the country. I mean, you can't hide from the economic factors that are uh, happening at the moment and the interest rates and the budget and all those type of things. But the reality is that the Gold Coast is a fantastic place and there are a lot of people who aren't affected by the interest rates who are you know, generally downsizing or looking to improve their lifestyle with uh, a second property on the Gold Coast that they can sort of travel to and um, hang out in on the weekends. So you're talking about the Gold Coast, but um, there's also a lot of, you guys have got a lot of movement happening down south and in New Zealand as well. So you're not just on the Gold Coast. You want to tell us about some of your other things that are going on? Yeah, we're fairly diversified. Um, we're a, a national agency. We've done, you know, buildings in Adelaide. We've done buildings in Perth. We're um, quite large in regional New South Wales as a project marketer. And we've got a great team down there in Newcastle and in Orange. And those projects are going extremely well for the same reasons that the Gold Coast is going well, that yeah. people are choosing that sort of lifestyle option for themselves. Everyone's talking about construction right now, building costs, all those kind of things rising. How are you guys feeling that out with what you guys are doing with your projects? Well, we're really lucky to have um, some extremely financial and strong developers who have diverse business interests that aren't just property. They mm -hmm. um, have quite strong balance sheets and, and use bank funding for their projects. Mm -hmm. um, we're lucky with Hirsch and Fagan that we've got Hutchies on all three of our jobs and our purchasers are extremely pleased by that. Um, and from that perspective, uh, we're also only, uh, our developers are only talking to tier one builders uh, mm -hmm. in um, the project we're in at the moment, which is 26 Vista for MRCB. And also talking about regions, uh, you guys are in Orange as well. Tell us a bit about that. Yeah, so Orange is a, is a new market for us, um, a market we've got involved in this year with the Mars Group, a publicly listed uh, company, and uh, we're uh, in the process of launching sales for their first multi-residential project down there. So we've just had the budget come out. What's your take on what's happening? Look, it's really a, a two-speed economy mm -hmm. from our perspective. Obviously, interest rates, if they haven't topped out, are heading towards the top of where they're going to be. First quarter in 2023, prices sort of started to rise in mm -hmm. March and April, but we're not hearing any panic. We're not hearing any pain. Um, our projects are obviously in A-grade locations. Um, the purchasers seem to have quite a large amount of discretionary income and they made an educated decision to purchase and in a lot of cases they've had you know quite a capital growth upside on their yeah. purchase so in the end they're determined to settle on those properties. 